Live report coming out of where? Live report coming out of Logan County. Let's go on to Rochelle Turner. Rochelle, uh, you know, we were uh, following that storm as you and our photojournalist Kyle Dollarheit were taking cover inside the Walmart during the tornado warning for Johnson County and Clarksville. Uh, and that tornado did actually cause some damage uh, not too far from Subiaco in the Scranton area. That's exactly right, and that's where we're at right now. We're just south of Midway in Logan County on Highway Highway 109. I know it's extremely dark out here. Rain is coming down. That's because there has been some significant storm damage here. There are about a thousand people right here in Logan County that are without power. But guys, take a look. I know it's extremely hard, but just far beyond right there, there's a power line that's down. I know it's extremely dark, but that line act that power line actually comes all the way up here by our car and right now there's crews back here working to get a substation up to try to get this area cleaned up there's even a tree that's down right here on our way to Midway we saw several street uh, street signs trees and debris scattered in the road on top of flooding guys as you mentioned just about two hours ago we were stranded at the Walmart in Clarksville that's also in Logan County because a tornado warning they made everybody go to the back of the building the wind was just so hard the rain it sounded just like what people actually say like a freight train was just coming through it was extremely loud but I did speak with Logan County officials about 10 minutes ago they did tell me just beyond that road beyond midway there is a home that did sustain some damage from tonight's storms i don't know if there anyone was hurt but i am working to find out more information but right now they're not letting anybody pass through this road we've had countless people come by and say hey when are we going to be able to get home when are we going to be able to get by and there's no set timeline right now they're just working on that substation trying to get everything up but again we are in Logan County on Highway 109 where there is a power line that's down. It's extremely dark out here. There's debris everywhere. There has been some significant damage. You can tell that there is something that has been here. And if you guys can hear, there's thunder rolling in. Storms are still coming in at this hour. So be sure to stay alert, stay aware. We're going to stay out here to see what we can find for now. Reporting live in Logan County, I'm Rochelle Turner. You guys got any questions for me? Well, uh, as of right now, Rochelle, um, have there been any reports of any injuries? That's a great question. I did ask that. That's a very great question. I did ask Logan County officials if there were any reports of injuries. They told me at this hour they have not received any reports of injuries, but I'm continuing to check back up with them because as these storms are still coming in, they're still trying to get out here to certain areas and assess some of this damage. So it's kind of hard to know what's going on. Cell service is kind of down. So I'm, I'm kind of lucky that we are able to hear you guys. But the wind is starting to pick up right now as we speak. The rain is coming down. So just, just be careful out there, guys. If you're in Logan County, be sure to be prepared. Stay alert and be sure to stick with the Arkansas Arkansas. Storm. All right. Thank you very much, Rochelle. Stay safe out there. Uh, still some thunderstorms in the area. Some very heavy rain continuing.